Hello, my name is Celicia Jackson. I'm a third year at the University of South Carolina, and today I will be talking about blood pressure. Blood pressure is the measurement of the pressure or force of blood against the blood vessels. Blood pressure is typically taken electronically with a digital monitor or manually with a sphygmomanometer like I'm using in this video. So to take blood pressure, we're going to have the patient seated, and we're also going to make sure that their legs aren't crossed and to have their arm that's being tested out and is in a comfortable position. Next, we're going to take the blood pressure cuff, make sure that it's the right size, and apply it to the forearm. And then you want the brachial artery being the artery that the arrow is pointing to. The pulse of the brachial artery can be found just above the antecubital fossa, medial to the tendon of the biceps. So now you want to test your stethoscope. So make sure that you have that pointed to your nose. Lightly tap. And if you hear a knock, then it works. So now we're going to take blood pressure. You want to put the head of the stethoscope right on the brachial artery. And turn the knob and inflate the cuff to 180 millimeters of mercury. And then slowly deflate the cuff. And once you hear the first knock, that's the systolic pressure. Systolic pressure is the amount of pressure in your arteries during the contraction of your heart. And the second knock is the diastolic pressure. Diastolic pressure is the amount of pressure when your heart is between beats. Normal blood pressure will be 120 over 80. Hypertension or high blood pressure is the most common heart-related condition observed in athletes. High blood pressure is diagnosed when an athlete has a blood pressure reading of 140 or greater on the systolic and or 90 or greater on the diastolic. And that's how you take blood pressure. So thanks for watching.